I have it's the dual deck, uh, the dual deck version of Chase Bellerin. So if you're running what I think we're running, you're running, then we're probably gonna get one game. <laughs> like actual one game. Uh, that's not so great. <laughs> Me neither, man. I feel you. Oh, oh, he got the knuckle first. Right. Oh my god, man. I don't know. Um, <laughs> how about, there's mine, you pick yours. Am I gonna get one of these today? Our ops. Oh, guess not. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you get it. Dun, dun, dun. It's like, hey, wanna play a game of rock, paper, scissors while they're. Dude, yeah, go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Because don't you know I'm a competitive rock, paper, scissors? You're gonna drop in magic. It's like, we've got rock, paper, scissors and, and magic. He goes nothing. Watch it win three of them. This is the best opening. <laughs> this is the worst opening. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Go. Oh, yes! <laughs> <Damn it. laughs> she is cheating. <laughs> Just no has gone really I, 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 I can see when this set first came out. This As is a what Trump people player, did there sure in their free that. time. You appreciate that. He does that all the time. It's just funny. Oh, yeah, yeah. And like, I got him like at least two times when we did it in the Tiny Leader game. Oh, yeah. Let's try out this. Oh, my God, this guy. <laughs> Something like that. Is he just that? He's good like that? Rock, paper, scissors, pro. Yeah, he chose scissors two times in a row, man. He chose paper two times in a row. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> scissors is strong. The scissors, scissors are strong with this one. I'll, I'll try. Let's start with an island. No, 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 no. Paper, paper, yeah, paper. Paper. Okay. You got it. No, 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 no. You got it that time. Last turn? Nobody's getting it. <laughs> Nobody <laughs> likes rock over here. Um, <laughs> poor Rocky. Poor oh, Rocky, man. Hey, you know, you know. Ass. I, I don't want to be good, man. Yep. <laughs> yes. oh. Power. Makes sense. You got Rocky. Finally. <laughs> Rocky, Rocky, got you. Rocky gets picked. Turn four, finally. <laughs> <laughs> we were seeing a SCG match. Not a, not on cam. I mean, it was a casual match, like one of their <coughs> versus series games, where they picked Rock each um, for the first three times they did it. Okay, you won. I think it was BBD and CVM, and they were just both Rock, both Rock, both Rock. Okay, that's enough. Let's just pick randomly. Tower. Uh, uh, Remand. <laughs> <laughs> that was like, that was a damn bird to think. Oh, uh, yeah, that's. Take the. What are you playing? I still you have to figure it out. Nothing that makes sense. <laughs> Never does. <done>. Platform? <laughs> <laughs> Flying Hexproof Manifest? <laughs> you took a picture of it. To show sure, right, race like that. Faster. <laughs> She likes magic. Yeah, so, she'll so really? the manifest yeah, she'll find flying and hiding as long as the enchantment is out. No, it's a bad three it's a, it's a And the only hard. time I ever beat her was she yeah. gets a bad <laughs> hand. Welcome to Fate Reforged. Get <laughs> serious. Yeah, I, I wish you had come yeah, in here earlier. Okay, no Tron yet? Yeah. Oh, Monday? Yeah, I, me and um, the other guy was doing two headed giant with those two little kids. Oh, wait, yeah, I was there. Except there was one little kid on with me and one little kid on Yeah, you were teaching the two headed giant. Was, I was like, you were teaching the wrong way to do it. I was right about some of the rules. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Though they were optional mm -hmm. rules. Um, My foot shots. But yeah, it, it was it was a good game. We we lost game one, so yes. the, uh, so the kid switched up his deck. I chose this deck with the one I was using, and then we just playing with that. And then um, here's those games. Yeah. Okay. Let, let's see if I can if I can one up yet. Cut, no, no, you probably can't because that's the cutest picture of you. Star. No, that's the cutest picture you've ever seen. Hey, but that's a baby. They're that's babies. Your wife. I told you that's your wife, man. That's the one up you. And there's also that smile of hers. How old are they? Uh, they are. What's today's date? The ninth. They are. Let's see. They're about half a year old. So they recently been born. Like they were born on my birthday. Combat? Wow. Okay. Hey, it's a birthday. 
Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> Pastor? Put this behind me before I drag this camera to the ground. Change the lands that are tapped. Same mana, I'm just color coding them, that's all. <laughs> the way she sleeps. Just like that girl, man. Actually, that is completely true. She sleeps just like me. She can fall asleep anywhere. But I mean, you see the plate of deliciousness right there. Yeah. Brr, I don't know, I'm probably going to sleep too. Wait, 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 That is adorable. Mommy, I'm falling asleep too. She's my little one. <laughs> She'll steal your food too if you are not careful. We we'll, we'll be sitting there eating That's something and then we'll look over and um, she's got some of it on her somehow. And it's like, how? <laughs> You're way over there on the other side of the couch. That reminds me so much of this character. Mm -hmm. Is that a name? I'm not that little bugger. I miss Vaseline. I miss her every time when I do the raspberry noise while she laughs and giggles. I miss her too. Oh, come back? He likes to hide when you take pictures of him. He'll hide under his covers. <laughs> see, I, I, I told you, every, every time you see her sleeping, she's got, she's like, that. Polymorph? <laughs> she sprawls out. Okay. <coughs> so there's a mana leak. And the technical order, I think, is that we move this way. There you go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I still want to build a discard deck with that as one of the win conditions. Oh, you could do that with Liliana. Mm -hmm. Like Liliana, think, with the Liliana verse that I have, you could do her net minus two ability to get that card to the top. Get Jay's Belera now and freaking. Well, I was, I was there like, green Belera. Big Daddy and Green Belera. Only for ramping this out faster. Yeah, but you and, could do Jay's too. You could do a blue black. That pre release. It's the only yeah, way. You, you, what, what you do is you keep making them discard all their cards uh, so that way all they have is like and then one I'll card. Pass the turn. And they have to either wait a turn to play it until they can draw a card to discard or they're going to have to lose it five It kind of just does it. yes. Or, uh, is how I like to think of it. Mm. I don't know. Hey Jay, is this yours? Yes, that is mine. Are you, you playing League? League of Legends? Yeah. <laughs> Your brother would probably appreciate this. The only card that actually stopped me in Tiny Beaters. For XCM Remote. I was playing a game of League and I got into a game with four other random people. And we instantly mm -hmm. all decided to do one of the most unconventional, usually the never works things ever. Five man teleport top. Instead. Now do so, be careful with those sleeves. Oh yeah. As I'm, not, in, I'm not shuffling hard so. Because I know how delicate your decks are so. That is a legacy deck so I appreciate Ooh. if you wouldn't. Oh, for the shuffle? If you don't mind. Oh, okay. Oh, that's, fine. That means it's money deck. Yeah. Put it down. Don't touch it. Don't touch it. It's a lot of soup. It's your turn. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I see why, though. <laughs> I don't even know what that does. Modern Runes. You can do Modern Runes. Is it Taxi Improv? Target creature you control gains protection from any color of the opponent. That's just a cap ability? Or Once again, we're getting to a game where you can have Tron without actually having Tron. Which is to say, look at how many lands you're getting. Huh. Okay. Runechanter's Pike. I'll pass the turn to you. Hey Jay, was this one of the you got bored that I decided to make an angel out of a worm? <laughs> I uh, I wasn't the one that drew that. Oh, okay. I actually don't oh, know. I did. Yeah. Just found it. Pass. He, he, he looks more like a um, taxi and fallen angel. Um, 
slash the demon with a top hat. <laughs> with a top hat. <laughs> that makes it all the better. Oh yeah. Top hats do make everything better. Why are you starting with a top hat? Well, I'm sorry. Pass turn? End of turn, thirst for knowledge. <laughs> Mana leak. There you go. That is such a good card to be in your legacy deck. Mm -hmm. That was interesting. So I'm guessing you will play the first turn with Tron's possible. on. Yes, Tron is on. That's why. Okay. It wouldn't have mattered anyway. That was the last chance I was going to get for a mana leak. Yeah? Okay. <laughs> Last turn. I'll go to ten. Next one, two. Serum visions. Okay. Spoiler alert. Well, okay. I'm trying to decide if it's actually yeah, possible to win this yeah. spot. Oh yeah, another funny thing is, is not only did we win that game, or not only did we do the game, but we won it in Washington. The score is like 43 kills to 29. But they, I don't think we, I think we let them take only a single turret. Yeah. It is 9.41. Wait, I gotta go in a moment. Last turn. Okay. So, in this draw, three of my computers. Alright. I'm just simulating because I want to learn how to play that. Ready for it? One top deck. Oh, no, no, that was not that the top deck. <laughs> Even if it was, you have remand. Yeah. Yeah. We'll do it. Yeah. He's a guy who pulled a turn There you go. go. 20 something bucks as a modern master. He's a pulled a turn of bird. Still? He has a no guy. Why? He's sitting on him like a modern master. That's where I stop. He's gonna make a lot of money for it. So look at him now, because he's still gonna go up in money anyway. Turbo goes on the bike. I'll keep this one. Alright, well, let's start off with Taxi and Pro. Man, I hate that card. Whatever you were doing. Now I know. And the funny thing is, with your tax info, you pay too light, you don't pay that. Unless you want to. Is that? I see what you mean. Granted, Ghost Quarter kind of gives you a color, but. Yeah, I'm on the draw. It's yeah. Alright. That's, that's fine. And then. Island. Sleight of Hand. It's like turn one, you see everything in your hand and draw two cards. Yeah. Uh, you talking about? No, he, he also did a um, slide mm -hmm. hand. Okay. okay. I want to make an armor pull Eon Spider. Either that or a Tricor or a Crosspass Halloween. I just nailed the discard. So you discard, discard till you hit Emiko. Cast Grizzle Pass. You dissipate. Get Emiko. Attack. Shuffle back. Emiko. No. When Emiko hits the, hits the grave, your graveyard joy, graveyard shot, yeah, graveyard shot until Emiko stays on the battlefield for one turn. Alright, so my turn. Yeah, it's till the end of turn. There's a bar I think it's either green bar or something else that I'm thinking about that you could pass onto, onto Emiko, get Emiko from the graveyard back to the field. You could attack, because this lasts for the duration of the turn. When, 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 when,
But you're doing it on the stack of Emrakul being in the graveyard first. Um, with his ability on the stack. He enters the graveyard, his ability is on the stack, and you do it on the stack. Yeah, so you attack. Once you get the end of turn comes, Emrakul gets shuffled back into your... With your into your deck, with all your great they're already shuffled back in. It's fine. Last, like I was saying, um, I'm gonna still like the idea if you ramp out Elvish Piper and then drop in Merkle next turn. Mm -hmm. Be a Elvish Piper and Quicksilver. I, I saw that. Yeah. I saw the Elvish Piper. I'm like, no. Latin Angel. That's a card. When I saw Elvish Piper in the, in the binder, I'm like, oh, no. That's a really safe from Emrakul, though. I could do this to Emrakul. Oh, my. I mean, I guess I why not? Right now. Or, get, or get the Emrakul off of John. Okay. Oh, uh, there's a card coming out in Origins that if you Combat? get any of it, I want you to hold it for me. It's LinkedIn? not an expensive card at all. Uh, let me find the list for it. Oh, just yeah. two flying experts. I don't know, but if I like what I get, though, I'm going to do that. Well, it's Polymorph? called it's Sigil of the Empty Throne. Okay. That's what I need. Mm -hmm. Let me I pull it up. I pull it up. So you guys. Oh, let me see the name. Sigil of the Empty Throne. I'm keep wanting to do play. that. Grizzlebrand. <laughs> now YouTube is yelling at me. Why Grizzlebrand? Because of what it's not. Why Grizzlebrand, Jerry? Why are you doing this? <laughs> Because, <laughs> partially because I'm about to draw seven cards. In five matches. Seven, right? Oh. Yeah. Seven for seven. Oh. Easy? I thought it was pretty good. Yeah. That guy. That's probably nice. Yeah, generally, I'm going to be better. Oh, it is. I'm going to keep them. I'm going to keep them between the water. Well, I was going to say, because this is an older version. I don't think I get them in this one. I don't think I get them in this one. Because I'm going green, and this is a one. Well, you get packs, though, don't you? Try on. Yeah, so there's a chance you can... Whatever difference that makes. But I might keep them if I get them. Yeah, because I have a modern enchantment deck list that is white, splashing black for a couple mm -hmm. cards. But the whole point is, is you keep recycling your enchantment cards using Othrios and Oramance feet. Because it's like Oramance or something you're interested in. Yeah, you need one more and get an enchantment back. And it's usually going to be a theory of um, armor. Um, um, Oramancer dies, are you going to pay three life to keep five the Oramancer from my graveyard, or does it go back to my graveyard? In that deck, right? Yeah, that deck. In that deck, you say, I'll pay three life to put the Oramancer in your graveyard. Because you don't want to do it. Go, okay, well, he's going to hit the bill, he's going to pull that thing yes. that ethereal on it. I bounce, re it. <laughs> Um, same with Hopeful Idol on in the day. Pretty much everything you have to pay the free with Ophrios on the field. Because it's all going to tear you up. And this just adds a lot of late game damage. Because you, you drop it, and you can, you can drop four four enchantments easy the next turn and get four 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 angels. Okay. Go to eleven. It's a one enchantment. Two white link four recycle that six <laughs> seven. You feel so powerful when you do that. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? Why that in Paul's cube though today? Mm. Oh my god. It's morph cube by the way. Yeah, he has a morph cube. It's pretty it's pretty sweet. On both games that I had, I would have won the game if I didn't do something else. <laughs> I feel you on that. I do. Against Will, I brought him down to five life. Against Paul, I brought him down to one. <laughs> one freaking game. So, yeah, so, um, Come back? I, I, I really want a couple of those to throw in that deck. I, I feel like it's one of the, one of the main cards that I've been missing in that deck. Back to 18. <laughs> 
Everything. At this point. No. I hate him so One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay, so drop it four. One more. Yeah, one more. Tomorrow's Friday, right? So you have the Does that one actually make it? Well, yeah. Yeah. I guess before we move on, I'll cast a Serial Visions first. Yeah. Wait, what is this tattoo? Uh, it's Whirler Road. You tattoo artifacts, 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 and part of the people. Yeah. And then it makes two more one. Now I can make that decision about the last one. I can just choose it. <laughs> Seven cards. Grizzlebrand, Anticipate, Jace Architect, Plot, Forcible. <laughs> Disrupt Michelle. That's the end of my turn. Okay. I love calling it Forcible. I'm a little <laughs> Oh, are you talking about in uh, standard or? Yes, yeah, Frag Okay. Uh, can't stop it. Really? <laughs> <laughs> no, no squelch in this list. No trick bind. Pass. You're dead. No, I, I can't pay life I don't have. Oh, it would have to be a multiple of seven for me to die. You can get me to four. Ah, oh, you're right. You can get me to four and then make me keep seven cards. Oh, that's true. So, still pass and turn? Yeah. In that case. <laughs> Only one land. So, I'm just going to operate on the assumption that. <laughs> because that always happens. Yeah. yeah, so triple remand, new changes, Pike. Uh, Ink Moth Nexus, Serum Visions, Disrupting Shoal, Polymorph, Grizzle Brands, and Okay, we're gonna pick 14 life. Okay, I'll be down to 4. I'm gonna. It's not like Spell Sky, where you can keep paying. Well, even with Spell Sky, if you have an odd number of life, it can't kill you if it gets you down to one. Well, actually, no, I'm gonna kill you. Axiom Oh! <laughs> no! <laughs> okay. So, this is another of those instances where if this had been Emrakul, this would be a different game. I keep trying Grizzlebrand, and it keeps failing on me. Oh, well. <laughs> That'll do it. Yeah, I'll just play with your two. Yeah, that's, yep, that's what work. makes Blue Tron worse. <laughs> yep. <laughs> Woo! I don't know the you have of the originals. I have the same exact ones. Okay, so I I've given you a couple chances, bro, but you're you're getting booted. I mean, Grizzlebrand ran is Grizzlebrand. He's good, but you know. That's not what I needed right there. Wait, who's so, are these? Oh, mine. I sided out to... Well, let me show you the side ins and side outs. Um, what else? Was that, that was it, apparently. That was all. And, I sided in spell pierces. Makes sense. Yeah. 
That's really good against me. Yes, I figured I was probably going to kill you with Mind Slaver. Yeah. And lo and behold, oil. you did. So the other two, I had Corrupted Conscience, and it's in here somewhere. See, there you are. So I was hoping that I could take control of your Warm Coil Engine and Platinum Angel or what have you when you got it out. <coughs> so, uh, Corrupted Conscience is in there mainly for a Tasker and for the Blue Tron match, since I know that you're here. And occasionally someone else will come and bring it. So Grizzlebrand, you're, you're off the island now. Because that Immortal Swing... Yeah. Um, hmm. Yeah. I... I tried. I don't really have any sort of recommendation. What do you think you're going to do in place? They're gone. Uh, one of them might become a Blazing Archon. Blazing Archon... Like, Emrakul, one of the tricks to this list, I could run Grizzlebrand maybe if Grizzlebrand would let me win that turn. Emrakul does not win you the game that turn. He kind of wins you the game the next turn. Because I don't get the extra turn because I didn't cast him, he just entered the field. Blazing Archon keeps me from losing. Oh god, in a mono blue list. I mean, I'm afraid uh, to lightning touch that, Greaves. <laughs> no, you're fine. Lightning Greaves, I get. Lightning Greaves. That's what I should do. Lightning Greaves, it would. It'd be fun. <laughs> it would. It would be silly to watch it go off once. Um, and then, <coughs> other than that, like, I, I honestly think that the main board is about as sound as it's going to be. I. Sometimes this is actual force of will, especially against removal. Um, I don't know though. I really don't know. Hmm. Oh well. Anyway, thank you very, very, thank you very much, my friend. I appreciate the games. Also, I did see someone who did an altar at a, an SCG event I went to. Well, 420 Blaze at Archon, but this is just one giant joint going out. <laughs> so that's another reason to play the card. Actually, yeah. I guess I might try Batterskull Mainboard. It I mean, is another non-creature creature. It gets me through the long game. It doesn't really work with the poly. Well, it, it does because it creates a germ token. Living weapon. Does it, don't you have to search a creature through the deck? Yeah, so it's not an actual creature. It's an equipment. That creates yeah, but when you're like looking for... Wait, how does the card work? Oh yeah, yeah. Polymorph is, is a confusing card, admittedly. So, Polymorph <coughs> says, destroy target creature, in this case the germ token. Uh, it can't be regenerated. But you have to, to reveal a creature card, though. <laughs> Immerkul. Immerkul's the only creature in the deck. Right, I mean, I was just saying Batter Skull doesn't work for that, like you can't get Oh, no, I, I meant it, I can't get Batter Skull, I can use it as Polymorph fodder. So right now, yeah. my Polymorph targets, I have four Ink Moth Nexi, three and in the sideboard, I can go into Batter Skull. Batter Skull may be main board. Maybe? I'm thinking of getting that again, but. <laughs> uh, I, I don't mean, Batter Skull wins the games. It does. You are not kidding. I could use something to play against Burn, uh, is another reason why. Yeah. But Root Chanter's Pike. Um, is the backup plan for the deck. If you don't combo off, you beat in with a, an X1 Infector or an X2 Flying Hexproof, or in this case, maybe an X4 Battle Skull. Maybe I could take one of them out, because sometimes they can get kind of redundant. Maybe, but that waters down the backup plan for the deck. I don't know. Maybe that's right. It would give me more hits. Is that like a good game No. No, that's a batter skull and a polymorph. Oh, another fun little fact. Um, I say fact, this isn't really a fact, but... So, polymorph, the art, has this person turning like their hands are withering into the spell pierce art. Half-Life 3 confirmed. <laughs> In all seriousness, I just found that coincidence. Yeah. So, I could do that. It's a wrap. Turning into an abomination. Turning into an ember. That's right. All right, man. Take care. <laughs>